Hello viewers, I welcome you to my channel on Excel Graphics and Multimedia. In today's tutorial, I'm going to teach you how you can generate your personal barcode in CorelDRAW. So let's get the tutorial started. Welcome back viewers. So the first thing we have to do in this tutorial is to make a new document by go to File. Then select new. So having select new, a dialog box will pump solve. So from this point here, this is where you set your page. So I'm going to name the design as barcode generated in Corel. All right. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to set my width to be 1920 pixels by 1080 pixels then i'm going to set my resolution to uh, my color mode to be rgb then resolution should be 300 once you are done with your setting click on ok all right viewers so the next thing i'm going to do is to create a page border for this design all you have to do is to go to your tools bar, then double click on the rectangle tools, a page border will be automatically updated. So the next thing I'm going to do is to go to my color palette here and choose red as my color. So the next thing I'm going to do now is to type my barcode number. All you have to do is to go to your tools bar, select your text tools, then come to the color work area, then type your text. So my text is going to be 234807490 This is the number. So the, the total number of this this uh barcode is 11. So all you have to do next is to start to generate your barcode. All right? So the next thing you have to do is to go to your menu bar. Then click on objects. Have a click on objects, go to insert barcode. So a dialog box will pop source. At this point here, this is where you set your barcode number. So at the point here, you type the number of your barcode. So you can just you just type the number of your barcode at this point. Then at this point here, this is where you select the format of your barcode. So I'm going to since I'm using 13 number for this barcode, I'm going to select this uh, EAN minus 13. So once you select that place, then come to this place, enter your 12 digit number. All right. So my 12 digit number is 234-8074901185. Good. So that is my 12 digit number. So having done that, the next thing you have to do is to click on next. So at this point here, this is this particular place, you remain, you leave it in 300. Then the inches is okay. Everything here, you don't need to touch anything. All you have to do is to come to this place and click on next. So at this point here, you can see this particular place, there is an, a greater than sign at the right side. But at the left side here, there was no the greater sign. So what, what you can do at this point is that if you don't want this particular place, sign to be in your barcode all you have to do is to click on this check mark to uncheck that but if you would like to have it on your barcode click on the check mark it's going to be there once you are done then click on finished all right so you can see from the screen here that we have generated the new barcode so what you can do at at this stage you can just delete this number away we don't need it again so i hope you learn one or two things in this video if you like my video don't forget to hit like button and also remember to subscribe to this channel for more interesting video in corel draw photoshop and adobe illustrator thank you for watching the video from the beginning see you soon bye